click the bell icon to get latest videos from Ikeda. Hello friends, in the previous topic we have discussed about the binding energy as well as the mass defect, also the relationship between it and here basically we are going to talk about the problem based on the binding energy and the mass defect problem number one. So now let us do this. So friends, this is the question which we have to solve and the question which is given here is the atomic mass of the sulfur having the atomic number as 16 and atomic mass number as 32 is given as 31.97 unit or unified mass. If the mass of the neutron and the hydrogen atom are 1.0087 unit and 1.0078 unit respectively calculate the mass defect. So this is the question which they are asking us just only the mass defect which we have to calculate so now let us understand what is the formula but before that let us take out the data from this question so that it would be very much simple for us to solve this numerical first of all the atomic mass of this nuclide that is for sulfur is given as that is we could write it here as m which is given here as 31.97 unified mass that is unit and talk about the other that is the mass of the neutron which is given so I could write it here as mn which is found to be 1.0087 unit and along with that of the mass of the hydrogen which has been given as 1.0078 unit and for that we have to calculate that is the delta m so for that we have a formula and the formula that we could write it here as delta m is equals to the total number of protons or the atomic number which we could say it as z m h plus a minus z for the mass of the neutron that is m n along with that of because since we are talking about the mass defect so therefore we could write it here as minus m that is the mass which has been observed so let us substitute the values and let's see what is the answer we could get so here basically we have to substitute the values so for z that is for sulfur we have the atomic number for sulfur as 16 so here i'll write it here as 16 into the mass of the hydrogen which has been given in the terms of the unit which is found to be 1.0078 unified mass plus a minus z in this case the a is nothing but the atomic mass number for sulfur which is found to be 32 so 32 minus the atomic number for the sulfur it is found to be 16 into mass of the neutron which is found to be 1.0087 minus the observed mass that is the atomic mass for the sulfur which is found to be 31.97 unit So these are the details that we have and now let's calculate and let's see what is the answer we could get. So here we have got the mass defect as 0 0.294 unit or unified mass. So therefore this is the delta M which we have calculated for this above question. And that's it. This is how we can solve it. So thank you friends for watching this video. I hope you have understood this video very clearly and I hope I'll see you next time. Till then, don't forget to subscribe. Thank you so much.